Serikali za kaunti sasa zitalazimika kuratibu bajeti zao kwa kutenga hazina ya dharura kutoka kwa hazina ya mgao wa fedha ili kushughulikia athari za mvua ya El Niño inayoendelea kushuhudiwa humu nchini. Kulingana na hatibu wa Ikulu Hussein Mohamed, shilingi bilioni kumi zimetumwa kwa kaunti na mgao mwingine sawia utatumwa mwishoni mwa wiki hii. Bile vile mkutano wa baraza la mawaziri leo liliafiki kubuni kamati maalum itakayoongozwa na naibu wa rais Rigathi Gashagwa. Muda wa kuwajibika kwa serikali za kaunti umewadia. Hii ndio kauli ya Hatibu Ikulu Hussein Muhammad aliyesema serikali za kaunti hazina budi kutenga fedha kutoka kwa mapato ya ugavi wa ushuru ili kugharamia athari za mvua ya El Nino. Hussein anasema tayari serikali za kaunti zimepokea shilingi bilioni kumi huku shilingi bilioni kumi zaidi zikitarajiwa kutolewa mwishoni mwa Jumahili. In that regard cabinet noted that the state uh, had allocated 7 billion shillings with which it is implementing various programs to address the plight of Kenyans across the country. The funds were appropriated by parliament and the contingencies fund as part of the financial the 2023-2024 financial year budget and supplementary appropriations number one of the same financial year. Hata hivyo sana sema serikali ilikuwa imetenga shilingi bilioni 7 kwa kusaidia waathiriwa mvua hiyo kote nchini. Cabinet also directed the National Treasury to further rationalize the current budget and, di uh, and direct ministries, departments and agencies uh, that is MDAs to commence reallocation of funds in their budgets to support the emergency response being undertaken by the state. Wakati wa kikao cha baraza la mawaziri ilidhamiriwa kwamba kamati maalum ibuniwe kushughulikia dharura mvua za El Nino nchini ya mwenyekiti wa naibu rais Rigathi Gashagwa kwa mujibu wa ikulu ya rais watu 76 wamefariki huku wengine 1035 wakipoteza makao kutokana na mvua ya El Nino kaunti 38 zimeweka katika hali ya tahadhari kaunti hizo ni pamoja na Isiolo ambapo watu waliopoteza makazi katika eneo la Ngaremara wanatoa wito wa msaada wa kibinadamu kupiga jeki juhudi za serikali ya kaunti kuondolea dhiki. The 38 out of our nation's 47 counties are within the alarm stage. Uh, a stage characterized by flash floods, general flooding in low-lying uh, plains, rivers busting their banks, landslides and mudslides, loss of livestock and destruction of farmland uh, and infrastructure. Katika kaunti ya Garissa halmashauri ya kitaifa ya barabara kuu imefunga barabara kati ya eneo la madugu na mji wa Garissa baada ya mafuriko kuiharibu na kutatiza shughuli za uchukuzi. Hali kadhalika waendeshaji wa gari na watumizi wengine wa barabara katika eneo la Kangeta na Lari County ya Meru wametahadharishwa kutafuta njia mbadala baada ya maporomoko ya ardhi kufunga barabara hiyo.